Hello, I'm Selena Cochran, the digital learning coach at Porter Elementary in Johnson County. I'm currently on my 17th year in education. This is my second year as a digital learning coach. I'm currently Google Level 1 certified, Level 2 certified, a Google coach, and working towards becoming Google Trainer certified. It is my goal to help serve our teachers. I hope to empower them so that they get the most from Google tools and empower their students. We hope to get improve our student outcomes and to create great student leadership. So today I'm gonna to share with you how to use Google Forms to create differentiated assessments. So if you go into Google Forms, um, here I'm working to create an assessment for area and perimeter. You have these uh, icons on the side and the very first thing you just hit plus, you're gonna add a question. And so I used an assessment from our iReady comprehension checks. Added in the question, you can add um, an icon or a picture here. And so I included that um, when working with the area so that they can see the illustration. And then I made it a multiple choice question. So when you're wanting to do the differentiated assessment, you want it to be a multiple choice question. And uh, I'll come back to this in a moment. I'm gonna show you how to add the sections before uh, doing this. So the next thing I wanna do is I wanna create a section two. And I'm gonna do that by clicking this right here, add a section. And in this section two, section two of four, I'm going to create uh, what happens if a child selects the wrong answer for question one? So my section two is going to be a review. Here you might just add um, a picture of a review, and this is like a reteaching uh, illustration that's in our iReady. And I've also included a video here. You can add that in by adding over here the side, the add image, add a video if you want in section two. Um, and then I'm also gonna click that little plus sign and add a question. So I'm going to add um, the same question from question one in this review. So that once that they review the materials and review the video, they can have another opportunity to get question one correct. And then I'm gonna add another section. So I'm gonna click this again and I'm gonna add a section three. And this is gonna just be question number two. So let's say they answer question one correctly and this is just gonna send them directly to the next question. As you can see, differentiating assessments with Google Forms can be a great tool for meeting your students where they're at and closing gaps and helping those students who are high achieving as well as those students who are struggling.